I live here. Eighth Man DVD. Cartoon Classics. Oh, 
snuffing. Well, I got one here. <laughs> you chubby little rascal. <laughs> Mr. Wabbit, I have a little surprise for you. Oh. Don't laugh. I'll bet plenty of you men wear one of these. That's the last straw. I'll get that Wabbit. Hey, Doc. Hey, Doc, where are you? Here I am. Too bad. Too bad. Oh, well. Oh, bury me now. I'm the lone fairy. Oh, do you lay who? Wait a while, coyote. Well, how long me? Oh, do you lay who? Gosh, ain't I a stinker? La ta ta ring. La ta 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 ta. La ta 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 ta. La ta ta ta. I came here for gold, and I'm gonna get it. No, 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 not that, not that, anything but that. Saber tooth tiger. Well, anyway, half a one. Well, this isn't getting me breakfast. Here, Fido. <laughs> before breakfast, too. Be quiet! Mm. Yum, yummy. My favorite vegetable, duck. Ha, 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 ha! 
like he's crazy. That is correct. Absolutely 100% correct. So that's the way it is, eh? All right, then. Cavemen get to go swimming, but I never get to do anything. Well, what are you looking at? Don't just stand there. Do something. Now go get it. The big lummox. <laughs> well, now isn't that clever? The hunter's helper. <laughs> now come on. for a guy that never took a lesson in his life. <laughs> Wait here. Duck breakfast. Gee, I can hardly wait. Come on, Fido. Wasn't such a hot idea after all. Good night, $152.50. Uh, 
you will, of course, uh, pay the bill now before you leave, no? Uh, no, no, I mean, yes, um, uh, my partner Daffy Duck will be re right back. He's out uh, he, uh, he, uh, cashing a check. Come on, seven. Be good to Daffy. Don't fail me now. Uh-oh. Snake eyes. Too bad. You is a dead duck, duck. for this week, Robespierre. You have insulted me! We meet on the field of onion!
Ah. Uh -huh. 
Especially we wabbits. You're free now with the wabbit. Go and womp and frolic in the forest. Oh boy, I'm rich. Okay, fellas, break it up, break it up. Three million dollars. <laughs> Angel in the sky. Come on out or I'll blow your head off. <laughs> I'm just an angel in the sky. Please, Mr. Wabbit, go on back to the forest where you belong. Be a nice with the wabbit. Ooh, ouch, ouch! Hey, what are you trying to do? Kill me? Are you fracture my skull? I'm gonna call Uncle Louie, that's what I'm gonna do. Operator, operator! Hey, you got a nickel? Hello, operator, operator! Give me walnut tree, tree, tree. Oh, that's you, Mert? How's every little thing? Please, Mr. Wabbit, don't call Uncle Wooey. I won't hurt you again. I promise. Well, okay, but watch your step after this, fat boy. Hey, what do you got to eat around this joint? Eat? Eat? I'll fix this guy. Fix he'll twig me, huh? Step right this way. That'll fix him. <laughs> Why the dirty double crosser? delivery. Your Uncle Wooly has kicked the bucket. You now inherit three million dollars. Inheritance tax, two million defense tax, paycheck county, which leaves you owing us one dollar and ninety-eight cents. Please remit. You don't get the dough, Aunt Butterball. No, but I'm gonna get you. Yes. <laughs>
pittance to bad wubbish. Easter greetings. to plug you, Mr. Duck, but I'm a sportsman. A great, great sportsman. <laughs> a great sportsman, eh? <laughs> sportsman. Listen, sport, you don't know the meaning of fair play. What chance has a poor, helpless, fluffy, little winged creature like me against you? You with your bullets, and your shotgun, and your knife, and your dip call, and your hunting coat, and your hunting dog, and all kind of stuff like that there. What protection have I got? A bulletproof vest, I suppose. <laughs> How does that get there? How would you like to meet me in a fair fight, Mr. Sport? All things being equal, man to man, Marquise of Queensbury rules. Huh? Huh. That's different, eh? Yeah, that's something else again. Yeah, you don't like that, do you, sportsman? No. Yeah, yeah. you don't like it. Yeah. <laughs> I like it. In that corner. <laughs> In that corner. <laughs> He's a dog. <laughs> oh, you can have him. <laughs> what a tramp. <laughs> That outstanding exponent of clean sportsmanship, the champion of champions, your friend and mine, our own, our beloved Daffy, good to his mother, Duck. Now, boys, fight clean. stuff. None of this. Or this. Or this. Or like so. Or this. Or this. Or this. You understand? Yeah, you mean uh, none of this? Or this? Or like so? Or this? Or this? Or this? Or this? 
Huh? How about a little of this? Absolutely, uh-uh. You know, there's something awfully screwy about this fight. Or my name isn't Larimore. And it isn't. You got him punchy, champ. He's practically a dead duck already. Now get in there, Slate. Go on in there and knock him out. Give it to him, champ. Let him have it, champ. Hmm, getting a little sin on top. How about a little something to stimulate the scalp? <laughs> Shake hands. Which hand do you take? Mm, uh, that one. Nope. Wrong. Guess again. All right, all right. I'll take that over there. <laughs> Ain't he a dope? You sure this is the one you want? <laughs> You're right. The right one. And here's round one coming up. One, three, nine, ten, you're out. The winner and new champion, Daffy Duck. I'm not the one to complain, Mr. Weffley, but I thought you said no woof stuff. None of this, or this, or this, or like so. Oh. Or this, or this, or this! That's all, folks! Look, 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 look
that they can never possibly mean anything to each other. Of a familiar fairy tale entitled 
the big bad wolf and the three little pigs. Set to the delightful music of Johannes Brahms' Hungarian dances. As the scene opens, we find the three little pigs building their respective houses. I'm the little pig that builds my house of straw.
Hey, get a load of this, folks. It says here, a constant menace to pilots are the gremlins who wreck planes with their diabolical sabotage. <laughs> gremlins. <laughs> oh, murder. <laughs> gremlins. <laughs> what a fairy tale. <laughs> Little man, oh brother! <laughs> um, uh, uh, what are the hubbub? Bub. These blockbuster bombs don't go off unless you hit them just right. Yeah? Yeah. Where did he go, George? Which way did he go? Mm, that way. Well, gee, thanks a lot, George. Thanks a lot. What's the matter, Bunny Rabbit? Speak to me. Why don't you say something? I'm only three and a half years old. <laughs>
I uh, better hurry. I just got uh, 10 minutes to catch my plane. Hold everything, Fasso!
right. Uh, uh, let's see what the kid can do. Okay, Sleepy, do your stuff. <laughs> Springtime blossoms bloom again in the garden.
just uh, he, uh, got some nice candy for you. Here, little he, he, auntie. Here, little old, old aunt fella. Uh, look, uh, look what Uncle Porky's uh, g -g 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 got for you. Here, old auntie, old, old aunt, old aunt. Here, Eddie. Here, Eddie, 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 Eddie. Here, Eddie. Uh, look at the pretty candy I've got uh, uh, for you. Uh, look at the... Uh, Freddy Cat, this is only a tiny little bird. You mean a poor little dinsy wincy itsy bitsy defenseless boy? Yes. Let me at him! Let me at him! I'll get him, baby! Gangway! I'll moitalize him! Let me at him! Take it easy! Take I'll it show easy! Him. Where's he get that stuff? Don't hold me back! I'll get him! I'll show him! Come on, quit your fooling. Don't get up that ladder. Push me, Abbott! Don't push come on, me! Come on. I'm scared to go up high. I get hydrophobia. No, oh, I don't want to come go. Up. Up. Oh, don't up. push me. Oh, come don't. On. You can't make me do it. You can't make me do it. <laughs> he did it. Come on, stupid. Get the bird. Oh. Give me the bird. Give me the bird. If the haze office would only let me, I'd give him the point, all right.
This witty pity went to market. Baba! This witty pity date home. Baba! This witty pity had roast beef. Baba! Well, what do you know? I ran out of pities. Baba! Baba! Here, put it up. Clowning, what's the matter with you? Aren't you ashamed? I don't know. Why do you do these things? I'm a bad pussycat. Oh, I just can't seem to get the boy. Ain't no use. Don't worry. I can't do it. This'll get you up there. Contact. 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 Excitable type. 
Now let's see now. The, the garage, the car, for the front door. And the back door. Ah, oh, here it is. Oh well. Ah, uh, no you don't. You're one to a west. On what charge? You got nothing on me. Oh, no? Well, listen to this. Resisting an officer, assault and battery, trespassing, disturbing the peace, miscellaneous misdemeanors, public nuisance, traffic violations, going through a boulevard stop, jaywalking, triple parking, conduct unbecoming to a wabbit. Nice looking chap, oh. Violating traffic regulations. And shut Why, look at you. You call yourself a Maori. You're a disgrace to the regiment. I'm gonna drum you out of the service. Another twig. No! Go ahead! Snap him on! Okay, Doc. Let's go. Ready, Mr. Wabbit? Yeah. Go ahead, Doc. I'm ready. Before you die, you can make one last wish. Yeah? Well, uh, let's see now. Um, I wish, um... I wish, um... I wish I wasn't Dixie. Hooray! Hooray! Oh, Cam Tommy sings his song. Do that, do that. Cam Tommy's back by my long. Fantastic, isn't it? Wine to run all night. Wine to run all day. I'll bet my money on a pop tonight. Somebody there on the bed.
just give lappen, give lopen, with the commandos and they're all over the place. Ooh, verstunken, from that ekler schwein. It makes me so mad if I don't listen more dope to the geschrei in the schieß on the shoes and the Ich weiß nicht, was der Lässer bedeuten, was es schnellen so kann. The sign of the old world over. It's the poor what gets the blame, while the rich is all the gravy. Now, ain't that a blinking shame? Put out those lights! Schultz! <laughs> It will be exactly 6.45 and one quarter. Schulz? Forty-five and one quarter. Mm. May I present you with this little token of our esteem? For me? Danke schön, danke schön. Oh, uh, just a little going away present. Well? See you around! Mrs. 
Messersmith. A whole mess of Messersmith. A mess of Messersmith. <laughs> bucks.
G golly, thanks. You saved our life. Is there anything I can do to re re repay you? Anything? Pimento University. Pimento U. Good old P.U. Pimento U, oh sweet P.U. Thy fragrant odor scents the air. A pox on Yale, poo poo Purdue. Pimento U, my college fair. Oh, Out and away, the most popular fellows at, uh... <clears throat> Out and away, the most popular fellows at old P.U. are the three Dover boys. Tom, the fun-loving member of the trio. Dick, a serious lad of 18 summers, plus a winter in Florida, as related in the Dover Boys in the Everglades, and uh, Larry, the youngest of the three jerks, uh, uh, brothers. A gay outing at the park has been planned by the merry trio, and they're off to fetch their fiancée, dainty Dora Standpipe, at Miss Cheddar's female academy close by. With their usual punctuality, the boys arrive at the pointed hour of three. soon on their rollicking way, forced to pass a certain public house, a tavern of unsavory repute, our young friends meet the distressing situation with their usual uncompromising moral fortitude. We know that even now, within this very tavern, Dan Backslide, the former sneak of Roquefort Hall, coward, bully, cad, and thief, and arch enemy of the Dover Boys, squanders his misspent life. Hark! The Dover Boys. Drat them. Double drat them. They are escorting Dora Standpipe. Dear rich Dora Standpipe, how I love her! Father's money. Confound those Dover boys! Oh, how I hate them! I hate Tom! I hate Dick! And I hate Larry! They drive me to drink! <laughs> Let us draw the curtain on this sordid scene and turn to more pleasant surroundings, where we find our young friends engaged in a spirited game of hide, go, and uh, seek. 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55. No, no! In here! No, up here, up here! No, no, over here, over here! Over here. In here. No, no, in here. No, in here. Over 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 here.
this predicament? Will no one come to her assistance? But hold on. What's this? It looks like an alert young scout. And that's just what it is. He'll not fail her, I'll venture. Telegram for the Dover, boys. Mrs. Tom, Dick, and Larry, Caraway with Tavern Upper Bottleneck, New York. Sirs, quote, help! Unquote. Signed, Dora. 35 cents collect. Chin held high, the stalwart sons of O.P.U. are here at hand to do or die. P.U. P.U., we're all for you. Yay, boom. Unhand her, Dan Backslide. Unhand her, Dan Backslide. Unhand her, Dan Backslide. Hey, we're getting in a rut. Stand up and fight, you coward bully cat and thief. Oh, you haven't been thrashed enough yet, eh? And now it is time to say goodbye. Goodbye.
Pardon me, Doc. Fresh out of carrots. Low bridge. I live here. That's my home. Such as it is. <laughs> Do I go around nailing signs over your house? Do I? There's still such a thing as private property, you know. Do you ever hear of the inalienable right of the sanctity of the home? Forgive me, my friend. Uh, do you like blackberry pie? Uh, no, no. Uh, did you say blackberry pie? Yum, yummy. We'll have some! <laughs> what a dumb bunny! <laughs> of course you realize this means war. I will press the gadget go, uh, press the get, press the target, uh, pr uh, pull a live rabbit. Yes. <laughs> Ruta, vuta, zut, and observe a rabbit. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> through the basket. There's nothing for it to fear. It's a trick. The swords do not penetrate. No. 
Uncle Dillingham duck. Did I cry spinach when I stood a duck on Plymouth Rock? Did I in Washington give up with their limp fortune hog? Did Dan O'Boone and me quite quits when Injun saved our scalp? Did John Paul Duck give up the ship or ever holler help? Hey, Daffy, Americans don't give up. No, Daffy, Americans. That's right. And I'm an American. Duck. Up there in the sky. It's a bird. No, it's a plane. No, it's Super American. instructive day may be spent at any one of the many fine zoos of our country. 
Here are assembled strange specimens from the jungles of deepest Africa. Rare creatures native to the highest Himalayas. Fleet-footed beasts of the plains and Pampas, as well as denizens of the mighty deep. At great expense and often at the peril of life and limb, they have been brought here so that you and I might know and understand our furred and feathered friends. The wolf family is represented by the timber wolf, his cousin the gray wolf, and the black sheep of the wolf family, the Hollywood wolf. You want to be in pictures, uh, you you. Say, here's an old friend of ours, Porky Pig, the keeper of the zoo. Hey, Porky, where are you going with that mallet? Oh, I'm uh, going to feed the giraffe. Look at this cute little bunny. This type of rabbit is known as the cottontail. And where there are rabbits, there are hares. Here we see the famous March hares. This majestic specimen of bird life is a bald eagle. <clears throat> I reiterate, a bald eagle. A bald eagle. Okay, blabbermouth. So I am bald. Before us now is the mighty monarch of the jungle, the lion. Well, his majesty acts a little restless. He seems to be looking for something. Oh, well. One of the most vicious animals is the black panther. This one is just finishing a hearty meal. <laughs> ah, the elephant. The African elephant. And from far off India, the Indian elephant. The most hated of all birds is the vulture. A sneaky bird of prey, an unspeakable ghoul, a loathsome scavenger, a snake in the grass with wings, a despicable excuse for a bird. Ah, sticks and stones can break my bones, but words can never hurt me. Yeah. The seals are getting terribly fussy lately. In fact, they're so fussy that they'll eat only fresh mountain trout. He uh, they, they don't know from nothing. <laughs> I'll toss him a, 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 a barracuda, uh, a mackerel. They'll never know the, the, the difference. Well, our friend the lion again. He still seems to be looking for something. Oh, well, we hope he sees it. The Alaskan bear is one of the strongest of all animals. He uses his tremendous strength to hug his prey to death. Once he gets those strong, Hey, hey, what's he up to? No, no, not that poor little sheep. Hey, stop it. Hey, cut that out. Put that sheep down. Hey, stop it, stop it. Stop that hugging. Oh, for goodness sake, mind your own business. When the swallows come back to get the strano. Residing temporarily at the zoo are three of the famous Capistrano swallows. Tell me, little visitors, why do you always go back to Capistrano? I don't know. I guess we're just in a rut. I can't do it. I can't do it. It's impossible. My gosh, there's a limit. Well, this daddy rabbit seems very disturbed about something. Hey, what seems to be the matter? This big brute is armored like a tank. 
His skin is so tough that even a bullet can hardly pierce it. That's right. In fact, over all his body, there's only one teeny weeny vulnerable spot. Oh, that's it! Oh, that's the spot! Oh, you got it! <laughs> I don't get it. <laughs> well, well, here's that lion again. Still looking. Oh, wait, he sees something. What is it that makes him so happy? Uh-oh, the ice cream man. That old lion has a sweet tooth.
was a tie. I thought quite a lot of the famous people in the storybooks I got. As I grew in size, so did I grow wise. And I've learned some things that really opened up my eyes. But in spite of everything I learned, there's one old guy who still ain't high as far as I'm concerned. Old King Cole, am a merry old soul. But the old boy loves to have his play. Old King Cole, I'm a merry old soul. But he waved his scepter with a swing. And here is a man who never fooled around. But daily he mixed with the tea. And now he's up yonder with a ring around. They call for Mr. Christian and went on a mute today. Old King Cole is a noisy old soul. Because he had his fling, and because he liked to swing. I went down in history. So perhaps there's a chance for me. Have you got any castles that you want to build, baby? You should swallow my book, Henry. I'll get out my scissors, that cut. You got any mortgages you want to have paid, baby? <laughs> with the memories of the bookland frolic. All is well. All is well.
Keeps the good work, strangers. Food!
Some soup or consomme, our chowder's good today, a T-bone bordelais, what is your order? You love our new green. 
green peas, or shrimp and cheddar cheese, and cherry if you please. A dear border, do try our bologna, a slice of salami, some vitamins A, B, just place your order. We have a candy yam, a moving picture ham, our short ribs of spring lamb, our shorter of buttered buns we boast. Do try our free French toast, and orange sherbet roast, give us your order. And with that tucked away, you'll know that that ain't me. That ain't hey, brother. A vessel. Ooh la la la. Ooh la la la. Ooh la la la. Ooh la la la. And now for our dessert. Mm. Uh oh. <laughs> now, fellas, wait a minute. Not that. Right. You don't want to eat me. I I'm not a duck anyway. I'm a pigeon. <sighs> I'm a hummingbird, listen! <laughs> Afraid of that fire water? Eh, hey, don't be silly. I just watch me, kid, and I'll show you how it's done. <laughs> I just cinch.
What you do? You uh, you go over there in the water to see the mine. Let's deliver the suit now. Besides, after you've got your walk, don't get harsh, Father. See you once. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh -huh. That looks okay. Yeah. Well, you're all set, kid. Now uh, you go in there and do your stuff. I'll see you later. Good luck. for this day, so happy birthday to you, the buzzard. Well, no, that's mighty neighborly, the buzzard. What now, a book? Just what I've always never wanted. Lions rarely live beyond the age of 10 years. 10 years? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Kushla McCree! One, two, three, four, uh, five, yep, six, yep, it's a uh, ten, all right, Leo. Absolutely right. You're not getting any younger, Leo. Nope, uh, no younger. Not getting any younger, he says. Well, I'm not getting any older, neither. <laughs> Oh, 
Don't miss the Bugs Bunny Show. Yes, everybody laughs at that carrot-eating character and his crazy pal, Daffy Duck, the big dame hunter, Peppy Le Pew, Yosemite Sam. Whoa, mule! And who else, Bug? The Oscar-winning Twinny Pie. I thought I saw a pretty cat. With Sylvester. And the fastest mouse in all Mexico, Speedy Gonzalez. And all the other cartoon stars, your family, and the whole world laughs at. In ABC TV's nighttime fun show, The Bugs Bunny Show. ABC Delicious Fun. Hey, it's empty. I gotta get some more post alphabets, cause alphabets are made from oats. <sighs> and oats are power packed with energy. Come down, Wabbit! <laughs> oh, well, am I? You're on your way home, Fudzy. Oh, thank you, Bugs. Now I've got all the letters of the alphabet. Yes, siree. Alphabet spell energy from A to Z with a capital E. Wait a minute. I am home. Just a little bit better. And stay out, Wabbit. Eh, uh, Doc, I forgot my alphabets. Halt, Wabbit. Those are my alphabets. They're A, B, C, delicious. A, B, C, delicious, E, F, G, G. I'm crazy about post alphabets. H, I, I was wobbed. Officer, somebody wobbed my post alphabets. I believe it was that crazy wabbit, Bugs Bunny. Uh, describe the goods, Doc. Well, Post Alphabets is the only cereal with all the letters of the alphabet. They're made with real oats to make you strong and full of energy, and sugar sparkle to taste just a little bit better. You mean alphabet spell energy from A to Z with a capital E. Oh, gee, these letters happen to be just a little bit better. Mm -hmm. Crazy wabbit. They're A, B, C, delicious. Get them quick like a bunny. Uh-oh. Uh, what's new, stranger? A new taste, stranger. Now, Post Alphabets is brown sugar frosted. Brown sugar frosted? Does that make every crisp letter made from oats golden? That's right, mister. Are new golden alphabets more ABC delicious than ever? How true, mister. Are new golden alphabets loaded with energy? Absolutely, mister. Then start your day a little bit better. ABC deliciously. Wait a minute. You're that pesky wabbit. Those are my golden alphabets. They were your new golden alphabets, Fudgy. Well, I'll be... I'm back with the only cereal with brown sugar on it. And the only one with all the letters, too. New golden alphabets. You'll get a kick out of them. Thanks, Bugs. You'll go for new golden alphabets, too. Just think, I used to be a nine-pound weakling. But now Post Sugar Crisp gives me the muscles of wheat. Muscles in his ears yet. Post Sugar Crisp is made of whole wheat. That's why it helps make you big and strong. So, start your day a little bit better with a sugar and honey and whole wheat treat fresh from Post. It's Ducky like Daffy. Ducky like Daffy. Get it? Sure they get it. All us tough bunnies get sugar crisp. <laughs> Start your day a little bit better. I gotta have some of that sugar crisp. Welcome, Doc. What can I do for you? <laughs> I'm all ears. I'm hunting that ornery rabbit. You mean the one who takes your sugar crisp because they're made of whole wheat to help make him strong? That's the long-eared varmint. <laughs> Haven't seen him. 
Darn me! Give me back my sugar crisp! Breakfast, Sam? Well, if you can't beat them... Get the muscles of whole wheat with Post Sugar Crisp. For breakfast, it's dandy. Or eat it like candy. Start your day a little bit better. Get Sugar Crisp in Post Treat Pack, too. Six sweet treats made just for kids. <laughs> like me and you. Howdy, partner. Say, how come you're not over in Cactus Canyon? They just had a big gold strike there. Cactus Canyon? Where's that? Straight ahead to the third traffic light, then turn left. Yeah, you can't miss it. Much obliged to you, sir. Will you stick around and watch my claim for me? <laughs> now that's what I call a wild gold chase. Here's what I'm after. Instant tang. Boy, this cold mountain water makes tang taste like it just came out of the refrigerator, which is the way I like tang best. For breakfast or any old time. And tang gives me so much pep, I feel like a new rabbit. Uh-oh. Hold on there, you furry varmint. Take my tang, will ya? Eh, happy hunting, Doc. Hurry, folks, step right up. Shoot a duck and win a jar of natural orange flavor tang. It's the new improved tang that tastes better than ever. Boy, I like instant tang, but I hate the idea of shooting a relative. Just shoot one little duck, duck, and get this big jar of tang. Tang? Goodbye, Auntie. You missed, but you can't miss with tang. And if you really want tang at its best, make up a pitcher full and cool it off in the refrigerator overnight. Great for breakfast or any thirsty old time. Mm. Just gotta win some of that tang. Okay, Aunt Duck, hold still. Why, you miserable tangster? Now wait, I was just kidding. March! Step right up, folks. Hit the rabbit and win a big jar of tang. Yeah, it's a living, but I get all the tang I want. I hope you do, too. I'm Yosemite Sam, and our craves a shot of red eye. Sorry, Doc. We only serve tang here. Tang? What's that? It's new, natural orange flavor tang. Rated than ever for breakfast or any other time. Yeah? Show me, rabbit! Easy. Just mix with cold water. All right, but I'm a aiming not to like it. It's delicious. It's even better when you chill a pitcher full all night in the refrigerator. Yeah? Well, give me some of that, too. Here's how. Uh-uh. Okay, you cotton-tailed rattlesnake. Dance! All right, but I gotta have me trusty rope. Dance! All right, all right, I'm dancing. It's the end of the line for you, pal. Can't I have just one more glass of tang for a go? Eh, one glass always leads to another, especially when it's new, natural orange flavor tang. Are you ready for the blast off, Wabbit? All set to be the first rabbit on Jupiter, Doc. Blast away. Five, four, three, two, one. The boot! At last, I tricked that crazy wabbit. He'll never steal my tang again. I always drink instant tang, ice cold. The colder the tang, the better it tastes. For breakfast or any time. <laughs> the best way I know to get even with somebody is to cut off their tang supply. So we'll just see how Mr. Wise Wabbit's doing without that delicious tang. Hey, look at that! He's landed already. Hey, what do you know? I'm in Tangrilla. Oh, no. Get new natural orange flavor Tang, gang. It's now by far the best drink on any planet. Post, makers of Post Treat Pack. Six sweet treats made just for kids. Start your day a little bit better with Post Treat Pack. Post. The cereals that start your day a little bit better. Post. Start your day a little bit better. Start your day with...
with the cereal from post. Start your day a little bit better. Better start out with the most. With a little bit better cereal, fresh from post. Tang, the instant breakfast drink that helps you to be strong and healthy. I like it. Tang, the instant breakfast drink that helps you to be strong and healthy. I like it. Alakazam, 
Mademoiselle Zerbe. Oui.
backward. Turn backward, O time in your flight. Make me a child again, just for tonight. And between these covers, we find these immortal favorites. Sleeping Beauty. Remember the lovely princess who was bewitched into a deep slumber until her Prince Charming came to break the spell? who got his name because he was no bigger than a man's thumb. Let's pay this interesting family a visit. Good evening, Mr. and Mrs. Thumb. Where's little Tom? Are you Tom Thumb? Uh, 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 yeah, that's me. <laughs> Why, I thought you were no bigger than a man's thumb. How did you get so big? Uh, vitamin B1. <laughs> the Grasshopper and the Ant. The story of the industrious little ant and the lazy grasshopper. The boy who cried wolf. Wolf! Wolf! Help! Help the wolf! Wolf! Help! Help! Wolf! 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 wolf. <laughs> what a joy! What a dope! There's a lad who could stand some discipline. What a dope! You'll learn his lesson someday. What a Jack and the Beanstalk. The story of the boy who climbed a beanstalk only to be met at the top by a ferocious two-headed giant who forced Jack to run for his life. Why did you quit? Uh, he's been sick. The wolf in sheep's clothing, the fifth columnist of his day. By means of a disguise, he preyed upon unsuspecting little sheep. Nights gave us the story of Aladdin and his wonderful lamp. All Aladdin had to do was to rub the lamp and presto, the genie appeared. I dream of genie with the light brown hair. Kid again. <laughs> what a joke. 
<laughs> what a joy. <laughs> hey, young fella. You're going to yell wolf once too often. Hey, go on, go on. Mind your own business. Mind your own business. Can a guy have a little fun? A session in the woodshed wouldn't do that boy any harm. And here's a bird you wouldn't mind having in your own home. A goose that lays golden eggs. Hey, wait a minute. You're supposed to lay golden eggs. Not anymore, brother. I'm doing my bit for national defense. Old Mother Hubbard went to the cupboard to get her poor dog a bone. This little nursery rhyme. This little piggy <laughs> went for to market. This little piggy he's gone for to stay home. This little piggy he's have rush beef and smash potatoes. And this poor little piggy he don't have anything, all kinds of things to eat. And this little piggy he's for to cry like anything. Wee 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 all the way. For crying out, pit sack, mother! Be careful! My corn! Cinderella and her glass slipper. A little girl Whoa! who... Whoa! Help! Help somebody! Help! Uh-oh. -uh. He's at it again. Whoa! Whoa! Help! Help the wolf! with a high hat and a whiskers on his chin, will soon be knocking at your door. And you ought to be in. The tall man with the high hat will be coming down your way. Get your savings out when you hear him shout, any bonds today. Come on and get him, folks. Come on, skip right up and get him. Any bonds today. Bonds of freedom, that's what I'm selling. Any bonds today. Scrape up the most you can. Here comes the freedom man asking you to buy a share of freedom today. Not, Not unless you buy a share of freedom today. Any stamps, any bonds today. <laughs> Now it's time for 
your brains out. Washed up. Don't worry, Blondie. I'll take good care of Baby Didit Dumpling. Thank <laughs> you. 
Boy, oh, boy, oh, boy, oh, boy. <laughs> Insomnia. <laughs>
Good morning, Oscar. Hi, Lug. Just get a load of that sea air. No, no, you can't do this to me. Come on. No, no, anything but this. Come on, it'll all be over in a minute. Got a tougher whiskers, huh, buddy? Watch this. Who threw that? Who wants to know? That ball off his dome. Drop that ball. Two o'clock. 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 I've been dreaming and scheming a way to escape. As the warden and guards, they all bore me. Life in prison was never meant for me. Although I hate, I said I hate to leave my cell, mateys. My loving buddies, a sorry, a so very, very, very sorry, warden dear. About time a scramming from here. And now I am going to go. Yes, I am going to scram. Oh, yes, I'm going to go, I'm going to scram, I'm going to take it on the lamb. A go! Bye bye. <laughs> bye bye. Nice voice, nice voice. Great possibilities. Fine boy, fine boy. He's gone. He's gone. He escaped. Why don't somebody do something? Do something. See, that's a good idea. Maybe I can do something. Sure. <laughs>
Wolfman DVD. Cartoon Classics.